Hello world and thanks for joining me. My name is Mohit Deshpande and in this course we'll be learning about clustering analysis. And in particular we're going to use it in the context of data science and we're going to analyze uh, some data and see if we can segment out different kinds of customers so that we can provide them with all kinds of neat promotional discounts or, or special offers. And this is a very common thing that's done uh, for a lot of companies is we have a bunch of data and we want to figure out unique groups of customers so that we can offer them uh, special things. So in this course, we'll be learning a little bit about three different kinds of clustering uh, algorithms. So first, I want to introduce you to the concept of clustering. Uh, what is clustering? And uh, what are some other applications of it? Then we'll get on to three cl different clustering algorithms. What's really neat is that they're all, they all approach clustering in a very different fashion. So first, we're going to learn about a very popular kind of clustering called k-means clustering. Then we'll look into a density-based clustering algorithm called dbscan. And then finally, we'll discuss a hierarchical clustering algorithm called hierarchical agglomerative clustering. And then we'll see different kinds of data where they work really well and where they don't work quite so well. So we'll get a good idea of at least some kind of notion of which clustering algorithms tend to work well on which kind of data. And then finally, we're going to tie everything together by looking at a real world data set and see if we can segment out different uh, customers. We've been making courses since 2012, and we're super excited to have you on board. Online courses are a great way to learn new skills, and I take a lot of online courses myself. Some of the courses consist mainly of video lessons that you can watch at your own pace and as many times as you want. So feel free to watch and rewatch and pause uh, the video as many times as you want. We also have downloadable source code and project files, and they contain everything that we build during the lessons highly recommended that you code along with me. In my experience, that's the best way to learn something is to get your feet wet. And lastly, we've seen the students who get the most out of these online courses are those who make a weekly plan and stick with it, depending, of course, on your own availability and learning style. So Zenva, uh, over the past six years, has taught all kinds of different topics on programming and game development to over 300,000 students across 100 courses. The skills that they learn in these courses are completely transferable. In fact, some of the students have used the skills that they've learned to advance their own careers, to make a startup, or to publish their own content from the skills that they've learned. Thanks for joining, and I look forward to seeing the cool stuff you'll be building. Now, without further ado, let's get started.